return. We also have the delta, the theoretical probability that the stock will be trading at or above our strike price at expiration, the Black-Scholes theoretical price, the Black-Scholes ratio, which lets us know if the option is overvalued or undervalued by comparing the actual trading price of the option divided by the Black-Scholes number, its theoretical worth, and the implied volatility for the option. Now, we also have the same risk-reward ratios for the other strategies displayed as well. As we scroll further down, we can compare the potential covered call risk and reward to the potential collar strategy risk and rewards for Walmart, the calendar call spread combinations for Walmart for the December expiration time frame, bull put credit spreads, the risk reward for bull call debit spreads, long call positions, naked puts, and all of the other strategies that we selected. Viewing multiple combinations at the same time in many different strategies will help an investor compare which strategy and which strike price best matches their personal risk reward tolerance for the stock they are researching and interested in trading options on. For example, Let's say that we wanted to trade the at-the-money covered call for Walmart. Since the stock is currently trading at $47.23, our at-the-money covered call trade means that we would sell the December 47 and a half strike call. If we sold this option against our shares of Walmart, we would receive a $0.90 cent premium this would give us a downside protection of 1.9% and a potential return if assigned of 2.5%. Our probability of being assigned on this potential covered call trade is 46.2%. Let's say I wanted slightly more protection because I was concerned that Walmart might have a significant drop in the December expiration time frame due to poor holiday revenue. Well, I can now compare the December 47 and a half covered call to the collar spread where I would still sell a 47 and a half strike call against my shares of Walmart, but I might also buy a December 40 or a December 42 and a half put for insurance in case the stock had a significant decline over the expiration time frame. Here we see that the net credit for the collar position would be 80 cents or 70 cents if we purchased the 42 and a half strike put. This would lower our return from the two and a half percent we had on the covered call trade to 2.3 percent if we bought the deeper out of the money 40 strike put or 2.1% if we bought the 42.5 strike put in addition to selling the 47.5 strike call. Our downside protection becomes 1.7% for the 40 strike put collar spread or 1.5% for the 42.5 strike collar spread. This analysis will quickly help you evaluate which strategy matches your sentiment and matches your personal risk reward tolerance. Once you have identified the position that best matches your risk reward tolerance, you can do further research on that position, whether it be a covered call, collar, or calendar spread, by linking the More Information button next to that strategy. Here we can link to the broker link that will allow us to place the trade with our broker. We can go to the option chain, do further research on the stock or the option, link to the calculator tools to evaluate theoretical positions, view the profit and loss chart, or add the position directly into the Power Options Portfolio tool to paper trade and track the position. 
The Strategy Search Summary Tool is a very powerful tool that will help investors evaluate which position might be the best trade for them on a stock that they have been tracking, whether they are bullish, bearish, or neutral in the current market. Remember, if you have any questions at any time, you can call our toll-free number at 877-992-7971 or at 302-992-7971 if you live outside of the continental United States. You can also send us an email to support at poweropt.com, that's poweropt.com, and one of our staff members will answer your question as quickly as possible. Thank you again for viewing the webinar on the Power Options Strategy Search Summary Tool, and we hope to see you again in one of our many other webinars for the various tools on Power Options and for the various option strategies as well.